a lot of offense and a lot of points on the scoreboard. Here we go with a pro TCU crowd just down the road from Fort Worth here in San Antonio and the Ducks will return the kick with the dynamic Charles Nelson shoved out of bounds. Feels like at the start almost like a road game and they're going to lead on that guy Royce Freeman who is a stud in the backfield and Mack when Oregon has but they're going to have to play well tonight. The so guys who've gotten more experience as the year has gone on first pass attempt and he's not going to get it off at swarming Baylor. In the regular season finale, a delayed handoff. Freeman got away from a couple tacklers, not the third. And the Ducks, Tate Turpin, he's not a big guy, true freshman. He can be really dynamic in the punt return game. We're going to see a returnable punt. No, it hits the turf and kicks out of bounds. That's number 12, the redshirt freshman on the sideline. They will hand the ball off on first down and a nice hole right up the middle. Aaron Green, the senior. Aaron Green will have a big game. They swing that pass out to listen be and that is covered well by the Ducks. Oregon showing some pressure and they bring pressure Cole House and delivers it's off the hands just a little bit off the mark for the first down. I still thought listen be could have maybe should have caught it fair catch signal and made their aspects they won their last six games they come in red hot here to the Alamo Bowl and Vernon Adams with his first completion of this bowl game. They'll try to get it to him as many times as possible. A quick snap. And Freeman with a big hole up the middle. Ty Summers saved an even bigger game properly. So now Adams from the shotgun on first down. Another carry for Freeman. And another nice run. Right at him is something that they're going to try to do. Adams faked it and keeps it. And Adams gets the first down. down. Take care of yourself. Stay healthy. Nobody in the backfield with Adams. And for now, nowhere to go with the ball being pressured. Getting to the outside and he'll throw right on the can I Benoit and Charles Nelson will get the carry sort of stumbles breaking a tackle and the little guy is one of the toughest players teams Oregon going quick tempo they'll throw it out to Nelson here on second down that one was defended well third down team this is third and four Adams in the pocket taking a long time taking a shot down the field touchdown. Seven yards to Darren Schneider. And his kick is up and good. So just like in the punt return game, TCU is dangerous here on the kickoff return, but that is a booming kickoff to the back of the end zone for a uh, TCU gets the ball for the second time. Bram Kohlhausen will swing that pass out to the right flat. And they got speed there, cutting it upfield. Cavante bonded him back. It's really second and seven. They'll hand the ball off here. Trying to get to the edge, Turpin, nice cut, kind of picking his way forward, and Turpin right. Kohlhausen, pressured, Kohlhausen will get rid of it behind the line of scrimmage. That's a loss of a couple. Four-man rush, Kohlhausen with a nice pocket and a nice delivery. A tackle short. One of their better receivers shows you how versatile he is. Quick snap, quick pressure, and the ball knocked away. No whistle, they say loose ball. Kept the arm going forward and thrown it. It was almost like he tried to stop himself and then the ball. After further review, the rule against the quarterback's arm was going forward. Therefore, it's an incomplete pass. It's fourth down. I still want to see the ball off the hand. A uh, punt on fourth down and not a real good one. But it will take a TCU bounce. It's fielded by Addison. Very dangerous. Difference of 59 yards of field position. Nelson gets the carry right side. Look at the speed of Nelson to the 35 and the cutback across the 40, across the 45, and it's clear. He's going to get another carry. Not as much room this time. Hit hard right at midfield. Gains a yard. Second down and nine. Freeman gets the ball left side running with that power. Back in college football, he was a part of it. Third and five. Adams pressured. Adams sort of stumbled. Keeps the play alive and finds his tight end. Bayless wide open to the 20. Inside. To the Get up inside. Keeps his eyes downfield for the completion. They fake it to Freeman and throw the ball out to the right side with a blocker out in front. To the 10, Dwayne Stanford tackled there. Carrington, one of those players. And Carrington takes the low throw, turns it upfield, knocked out of bounds. He got the first down. First and goal, Oregon. The play fake. The throw incomplete. Braylon Addison. Second and goal. 
Freeman gets the carry. Freeman, that cut, and the power. Touchdown. Tonight, point after try, good snap, good hold, kick is good. Offense tonight, so far not so much. Now kick it off deep, and again a booming kickoff for a touchback. Well, we've taken two things on Boykin. We'll see if Colehouse and a TCU can get it going on offense. So far, Aaron Green, Green shifted Colehausen. Pressure picked up. He's got plenty of time and a very tight window. There's Turpin out into the open. What a move inside the 50 down to Oregon territory. Uh, Coach Roll used to say he's like a puff of smoke. Well, we like to watch him, but it's hard with all the speed. Now there's a penalty flag. Illegal block below the waist, number 25 offense. 15 yard penalty from the spot of foul. Replay first down. Back in their own territory, another four-man rush picked up. The throw short is caught to that corner, jumping over. Still second and long. They will hand it off on second and long into Oregon territory. That's Kyle Hicks. Kohlhausen pressured, steps up. Kohlhausen taking a deep throw and incomplete. Man, back down. 65 off. Fourth and 14, TCU will punt. And an end over end kick. Fair catch signal. Addison makes it at around the fifth. Adams and company back on the field. Play fake. Adams, the ball is knocked down incomplete. Five receivers in this formation. Adams in the pocket. He'll throw deep right side. Addison out there incomplete. Good coverage. And as much as anything else, and the rest their defense. Sprinting right, Adams, pressure, gets away. Adams heaves it downfield, and it is caught! What a catch by Darren Carrington! Jumped him for, to make the play. Quickly to the line of scrimmage, a little shoulder fake, and another deep throw. This one is caught again! At illegal touching, number two offense, went out of bounds on his own, came back in. Bing. Otherwise, but I, I didn't see a lot of contact to force him out of bounds. Well, they'll get the ball in the hands of number 22 again. And so far in this game, that has been a good thing. And well, final minute and a half of the first quarter. Royce Freeman with the carry. Freeman down to the 20-yard line. Let's go. Tag forever young 22 for his friend. And he is playing like an inspired kid tonight. Adams on the move. Throws a dart. Caught at the five. Tight end in motion. Royce Freeman, touchdown! Kick is up and it is good. Place before he said in a spring game, well so far, his first quarter has been really impressive. Got a line drive kick, it'll bounce into the end zone for another touchback. TCU's offense comes on the field. No, Matt Lewis does help to have as many playmakers as the Ducks yeah. have. Yes. Turpin gets the pitch back. Turpin will be sworn. And I tell you what, the only to feel like they could get back in this game on second down and long. Kohlhausen dumps one short left, incomplete. And I think back part of the story 12 in the shotgun. Kohlhausen steps up. Kohlhausen goes down. And for his senior year and has been a great leader on this team. They'll try to angle the punt, and that one will go out of bounds. A low-line drive kick to give Oregon a pretty good field position at their own athletes, also the president of the United States. Vernon Adams throws on the move, another perfect pass. Plays of 10 or more yards in this game so far, eight of them already for the Ducks, and they're going to get another one here. A big play! To the 20, to the 10. Eds guys are loaded with skill guys. That's their fourth string guy. And he'll stay in. Touchdown. My goodness. They are hitting on all cylinders right now. Defensive players. We got a chance in this thing, guys. That one is up and good. Yeah, Stanford improved as much as anybody in the country from that opener at Northwestern.
to the Rose Bowl yesterday. Very yeah. impressive by David Shaw. Be impossible to improve more than they did. They were so. Another question pertaining to this game. TCU, can they possibly figure out a way to get back in this thing? Not with the way that, that Oregon is. 13 minutes to go until halftime. Oregon's over 300 yards of total offense. You're looking at a record setting type performance. Penalty flag behind the play if the play stands. Another holding hold. number 74 offense. 10 yard penalty from the previous spot. Replay second. Cole Housen, play fake. Over the middle, nice pass and a tough catch with contact. You've got to have plays like that down the field to get going. 19 yards, now they hand it off and get a positive. A Pac-12 team over a Big 12 team, Kansas State. And it was close by the end. There's some speed out of the open. Turpin, Turpin still going into Ducks territory. And he never went down. Final. Can absolutely fly. It's fun to watch. Now they hand it off to him as a running back. He took a 150 pounds. But he is fast. The cutback to the 30 and now the ball is out they have blown it dead though TCU ended up coming four down territory third and four in the pocket with time now running out of time and a heave out of bounds incomplete fourth down and will test Kohlhausen down the left sideline and incomplete now they threw the ball deep intended for Oregon and it has been for TCU. And a lot more fun. Hand uh, off up the middle. Royce Freeman stuffed that time. A rare positive. Vernon Adams fakes it to Freeman. Scrambling. Adams keeps the play alive again. Now pressured. And this time he goes down. Now the ball did pop out there. Down. After the play, personal foul, unnecessary roughness, number 94 defense. Well, yeah, I mean, I agree with Bill. Even if the play's down, though, that's a sack. It's third and very long. Now it's first down, Oregon. And Nelson out into the open field. What a move from Charles. Can't tackle him one on one. First down, Ducks. Freeman straight ahead into TCU territory. So with that penalty, Oregon's here. Adams. Just a four man rush. Throws kind of off his back foot incomplete. Can get back in this thing. And they are going to fake it. A throw from the punter is caught and then knocked away incomplete. Has the ball back and good field position. Handing it off to Green with that nice cut back across the middle. Close to a first down. I'm starting in place of Trevon Boykin. Another handoff again straight ahead. This is Kyle Hicks. A pretty powerful run against TCU. After the play, unsportsmanlike conduct, number 25 offense. 15 yard penalty. Territory now at second and 17. Back around midfield. Kohlhausen scrambles and throws. It is caught. Pretty acrobatic. 13. Oregon showing pressure, and they bring pressure. Kohlhausen flings it away, incomplete. Then he gets tossed down at the end of the play. A good no call. Now a punt, that personal foul on sportsmanlike penalty was huge for TCU. That's being a perfectionist. Hand off on first down, a nice hit against Benoit out in the open field. Come out and go 6-0. Low snap, Adams throws that slant, dangerous pass. Good catch from Carrington, but a good tackle for T Adams. That one is juggled and incomplete. Position then, so we'll see if the result is the same. Here, pressure, and the punt is blocked. Oregon Buckner grabs it and runs forward. Nothing, no breaks right now for TCU. I mean, seriously, they blocked the punt near the goal line, and it works in favor of the Ducks. Now it is Griffin with the carry out near first down. It was a tremendous play by Buckner. Now Adams keeps it and takes a huge hit. It's second and six for the Ducks. Handoff straight ahead running. And Tony Brooks James tackles short of the first down around the third down low snap. Lockie spikes the ball into the turf. Now a penalty flag throw. They'll call it an incomplete pass. Is it intentional grounding number 17 offense. Quarterback was in the pocket and there was no receiver in the area. Penalty is lost. The TCU really come after him more here now that Vernon's out of the game. Turpin, 
toward the sideline. Fair catch signal. And he will make the catch at around the. Uh, the initial look, he wondered, well, should there have been a penalty flag thrown? A juggle and an incompletion. Especially up front, dominating. Handoff and nowhere to go. Hicks cuts it upfield, just swarmed. He goes down, tried to get back. On third and 12, Kohlhausen, deep middle, right into coverage, intercepted. We'll see if Oregon keeps the ball on the ground. They do hand it off to Taj Griffin. Griffin. Another low snap. Freeman, nowhere to go, and he goes down. Now, stop on this third down. They stop the clock. A delayed handoff with a big hole. Freeman will get the first down and more to midfield and still going. 24 yards. They'll give it to him again. Freeman. Churning that is tough power running. He kind of got overlooked in all that talent, all that production. There's a completion from Lockie out to Addison. First down, or who had a tremendous year as well. Those numbers coming into bowl season. Another catch for Carrington, who's been a big play. His best friend, who died very tragically in a car accident just a couple weeks ago. That went into New Year's Six Bowl game. This year down 28 nothing here in the Alamo Bowl. That throw is caught. Now the tackle, three yards to go. Lockie, low snap again. Hand off, first down and more. Now there is a penalty flag. Illegal shift, offense. Player in motion while the linemen going down to their stance. Five yard penalty. Kicking indoors. That kick is on the way and it is good. Thrown it, they've run it. Kick off, and even those have been impressive. Another touchback. Now, final 32 seconds. TCU will get Turpin into the open. Turpin with all that speed. <laughs> How about the safety with speed at a half? So TCU is taking a chance, throwing it downfield. That one's incomplete. And in the regular season, uh, we highlighted the offense in Carrington there, but everything that Oregon did in that first half was impressive. TCU will. Take a knee, a touchback. Jim said it's not likely. Well, they will run forward, throw backwards, and try a trick play with a nice delivery into the open field and a good start to the second half. It's a total parallel with no Boykin. TCU will hand the ball off here and a nice hole for Green into Oregon territory right away. Now we'll see if TCU can pull it off. Green. First down, Horn Frogs on the move. Well, and we enthusiasm intensity as they left at halftime. Another handoff, and that one down with a penalty flag. That's 10 yard penalty, first down. Second. So you never know what happens in the second half. Did you change your shirt? I didn't change my shirt, but we did have Vince Young. <laughs> I came back and tied it up. This team's not going to quit. Uh, no Vince Young for TCU, so Gary Patterson changed the wardrobe. That's a nice turn up field and a first down TCU. Comfortable quarterback for TCU. Everything's working right now. That was for 18 yards. This is for much more inside the 10. And this gives them a chance to pick it up on defense as well. First and goal. Good defense that time. Number 33. Totally different without their star quarterback. Kohlhausen in the pocket now trying to run. Goes into a slide. I think that on the 10. Sprinting right and keeping it. Now that's an interesting opening. And just made a play on his own. The kick is up and the kick is good. Well, they got those points. Not coming back in this game, and who knows? Oregon so dominated the first half. He was a big reason why. We'll see if that helps TCU get back in things. Nelson with that speed to the 30, and he makes a man miss. Nelson across the 40. I think three games. Hands it off to Royce Freeman with that cut up field. Freeman, he's tough to bring down. What a hole. A lot of running room. Now the snap goes right by Lockie. He wasn't ready for it. He's got to get on the ball. He does. It'll be a big momentum if they can get off the field on third down. Huge loss, and they'll just hand it off to Freeman, who breaks a tackle, but not a second. Traven High, fairly short kick. Turpin with the fair catch signal. It hits the turf and taken long. Bram Kohlhausen. Hands it off. Green is swapped and driven down for a big loss by that defensive. Absolutely. And it should. 
Second down and long, pressure immediately. Kohlhausen on the move, across his body, and that throw is eight in this game. They need 13 here. Better protection this time, that delivery on the money, and then a slip tackle for a much bigger gain. It is a first. For TCU, a little slower tempo on this first down play again. Lots of time to throw, dumps it short, and Hicks breaks a tackle himself. The Oregon final liner would be LaMichael James. And off to Green, who gets swarmed and dropped for a loss. Territory for TCU. That swing pass. And a nice tackle, although Turpin lunges. And they will get the ball snapped. Hand it off. Hicks with a nice cut, trying to get there. And we'll see. I think he got it. And now especially minutes to go third quarter. That, I think, was a backwards pass. And now another pass with a flag down. In fact, two of them. Substitution, 12 players in the formation on the defense. Five-yard penalty from the previous spot. Replay first down. Most penalties have hurt. First and 10. Green down to second and eight. Play fake. More flags thrown. Toward that sideline with illegal formation. Five players in the backfield. Offense. Penalties decline. Third down. Kohlhausen. Steps up, throws on the move, pass is caught. The receiver, though, had to first down. And ran, run and hand it to the receiver. Run. Fourth and five toward the end zone, and it's caught! Touchdown! Jalen Austin! By Jalen Austin. Extra point up and good. Well, the field has changed. And after the touchdown, TCU will kick it to Nelson and Oregon. Nelson, this one's returnable. Nelson on his feet for how long? Not long. He's going down. Now the ball comes out at the end. I think he was down, although live ball. This could be Running TCU on the field ball. Is a fumble recovered by TCU. Down. Is that ball moving? Firm. First down. Wow. Who just a moment ago threw the touchdown on fourth down. He will throw here. It's incomplete. Good play on the ball. Knocked down. They got both Green and Hicks in the backfield. Kohlhausen, that looked like a designed run. And he takes a big. In the pocket. Kohlhausen, now he will run. Kohlhausen dives and goes. Of him or what? On first and goal. Turpin did not get there. Stacked up by the duck. Handoff. Stutter step. Close. Touchdown. Field was touchdown. After further review, the ruling is the ball did not break the plane of the goal line. It'll be third down. In the shotgun. Third and goal from the shotgun. Tight end in the backfield. Handoff. Green gets stuffed. In fact, he lost a yard, maybe. Hicks behind. Play fake. Trying to throw. Now trying to run. Kohlhausen, touchdown! Back, and the team is feeding off the same thing, and that staff saying, we've been here before, guys. Just thought the fans should wake up before the team does, but they always do afterwards. That one will be a touchback while we have a moment. Now Jeff Lockie in the shotgun. Freeman with a big hole and a tough run outside the 30. Close to on second down. Lockie hands it to Freeman again. Freeman will get close. It'll depend on the spot. I think forward cross of humor can help. So start of the fourth quarter. Another snap that was low Freeman though took the handoff and made a nice positive gain for Oregon so that Freeman and they're gonna make the big guy carry the load here in the fourth quarter Freeman spinning off tacklers and he'll get the first down nice run this could be a factor in the fourth again Freeman gets the carry and you figure they are gonna want to ride him in second half yards you think they miss Vernon Adams that would be a yes Benoit got drilled 
Low snap on the turf. Was he down? Apparently not. And yes, he was. He was down. Oregon thinks it's got a touchdown, but his knee that is. Once again, low snap. It bounced. A positive coach. He doesn't need to be beating that young man up when you got uh, 12 minutes left to play. Fair catch from Turpin, who lets it go over his head, and it takes a great bounce for Oregon. It'll be down inside the 10 around the TCU with all 17 since halftime. And now the play is blown dead. Another pre snap penalty. Ball snap, ball start, number 28 offense. Five yards or half the distance to the goal. Still first down. So even for the Oregon defense to make a big play. Play fake. Kohlhausen throws incomplete. He threw it behind his intended. Kohlhausen going to throw again. Good protection. That one is caught, it looks like. Yeah. Almost like he was faking a pooch punt. Now he'll throw deep. Caught! For first down. That is huge. Green's going to get the carry here. Nice burst. Jumps over a tackler and close to a first down. Not quite. Ducci left the game. Handoff Green. That's a first down. Just a couple yards. Much faster than they did in the first half. Oregon's probably slowed it down. That was a fast snap. Green gets a couple. Play fake. Kohlhausen steps up. That throw is complete. And now they're moving. Lining up fast and playing like Oregon did the first half. 21 yards. Green kind of skidded on the turf. And then just stopped. And off here. And I guess it was a good decision. He didn't call timeout because that was well. Receiver in motion on third and eight. Kohlhausen pressured. And the ball's out. It's out on the turf. TCU fall. More field goals made than anyone in Big 12 history. And add another to that total. Well, maybe you call that a victory for back the whole night. But Jeff Lockie in Oregon, they need to get some offense going. Addison with the catch, and he goes backwards. Game. Under seven and a half to go. Freeman with the carry. Freeman lunges ahead. Inside the 45, close to the... Low snap again. Lockie heaves it incomplete. They can't board. If you can't get the ball snapped to the quarterback, you can't play football. Fair catch, angled kick, and another great punt. Early final 6:40. TCU gets the ball back. Kohlhausen dumps it short, and the pass is caught with some running room. Nixon penalty flag thrown. A big foul for offensive pass interference. The pass was caught behind the line of scrimmage. First down. Okay, so now that we don't see tonight here in San Antonio, final six plus. Kohlhausen keeping it. Kohlhausen with that ball sort of wobbling around. What strategy changes? On second and short, a play fake. Sawyer running around, penalty flag thrown. He'll get the first down, but again, I think that the snap. Pressure comes immediately. He takes a hit and delivers the ball on target. And now the so it's third and three. This is a huge play. And Kohlhausen will try to scramble. He dives forward, and he got that clock is definitely the ally of the Ducks, though. Kohlhausen throws. That pass is caught. The defender fell down. Austin on the move. Down the sideline. Finally out of bounds to go. If you're joining us late here in San Antonio, it was 31 to nothing, Oregon. Kohlhausen, wide open receiver caught. Kohlhausen. Pressure comes toward the end zone, and a penalty flag thrown as the ball gets... That is lopsided. Now it's almost like a wildcat. Direct snap to Green. He gets a block from the quarterback, and touchdown. Call out. Come back. It is Sawyer, who is the quarterback on the two-point play. They pitch it over, and the throw. Two points. From Neff. Possibility of an onside kick? No. It's more like a pooch kick. Addison over the shoulder. Bobbled it. That's a live ball. Addison will get to that corner and did well. Just running back. They will give it to Royce Freeman. Trying to get to the corner. Now cuts it ahead and gets tackled at the 10. Allison Williams. And noise. Oregon can still win this game on offense. Lockie throws incomplete. And Playing tight man. 
Low snap again. Pressure again. Lockie dancing around. Throws it away. Stop to Turpin. Who runs 10-2. Wheeler gets it off. And that's a returnable kick. Turpin is not the return man. TCU brings it back. And they'll have great field position. Des down. They get the play snapped. Kohlhausen throws short. Nixon for a gain of second and five. Handoff left side. Good blocking. Green now finally down here than it is on that sideline. Well, you're right about that. Handoff Green. Not a lot of room that time. Now TCU now is definitely, no matter how much he sweats. Handoff again. Green, nice cut. And Green. It to go. Another handoff. Green. Ankle tackle. He has under a minute to play. Another handoff. Squirting through. Spin move. Green. And I think he got there. It's real. Third down. Third and one. Kohlhausen rolling right. Looking for the end zone. Instead, he'll throw it away. And now on fourth down, I think you're in the middle. He'll see him kick the field goal. Kick is good. And they've come all the way back. Try to get it to a big guy. Well, they kick it deep. Nelson, I mean, this is returnable for a very dangerous guy. Nelson to the 20, out into the open, stays on balance to the 40. Nelson finally. Lockie. Tight man was too deep. We'll throw it to Freeman. Freeman trying to get to that sideline, gets shoved out of bounds. Two seconds, final play of regulation. Pressure immediately, and they won't even get a throw off. ECU gets it first in overtime, and they will pitch it to Nixon to the corner. Nixon will go out of bounds after second and seven. A little pump fake, and Cole House is running. First down, goes into a slide. And if you're Oregon's defense, you receiver in motion. Kohlhausen handoff. And those legs keep moving. First. Kohlhausen. End zone. What a catch! Touchdown! Now this is huge in overtime. Extra point up and good. So they take care of the room. Locky handoff Freeman and Freeman lowers those shoulders gets five yards down to the 20 and Jeff Lock fake it to him Locky pressured got away once not that time and we the good and the bad another play fake Locky dancing around it's batted down Locky and he's got Freeman for the first down. Freeman's still going. It's to snap the ball. This ones were too slow for him. First and goal. Freeman stops short. Got to get the snap. Good snap. Freeman trying to push his way in. Touchdown. What a player that guy is. TCU's defense played great. And he just kept moving. His He's never missed one of these. Kick is good. He still has it. Hockey and company, they got to do it again. A low snap taken cleanly toward the end zone. Incomplete. Carrington was there and he just. But they hand it off to Nelson. Nelson goes down. One. I see him on the sideline now. Not in the game. Lockie on third down. A screen type play. Addison and TCU read it perfectly. Good snap. Kick kind of wobbles, but it's perfect. I did look. TCU wins. Kohlhausen and the TCU offense on the field. Passing with some pressure coming, and that throw was high. He had his man open over the middle. That was Tony James. They get it snapped, and the running back was not in the right spot. So toward the end zone, jump ball incomplete, knocked away. Now that game might bring some pressure. They're coming after him. They do. And they get there. Kohlhausen dumps it off. It is a tackle for Oregon from about 46. The kick is good. And we TCU has it first. Green carry. Big hole. Green will get brought down. Hand off. Green again. Trying to bounce it. And he'll stutter step. 
Kohlhauser. Almost like an option style play. He'll turn the corner. Touchdown. You have to, Gary. Got to go for two. Here's the two point try. Sprinting right. Now backing up. Pressured. Kohlhausen across his body, bounced it. No good. Triple overtime. They got to score a touchdown. Toward the end zone. Incomplete. Blocky hands it off on a misdirection type play. Freeman tackled short of the first down. He got low snap. It's on the turf. To keep the game going. At low snap, Lockie pressured, stepping up. Lockie throws, incomplete! <laughs>